Does he, do you have the fish or does the fish have you? Oh, I got him. I got him. Oh, oh boy. He's a pullet. Oh, he doesn't want to get down the boat. He doesn't Come want your new address? Obadiah. Come to me, Obadiah. Stop. He don't want to change his address. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, his new address is Buckingham, right. PA. Oh, boy. You fellas are going to be so so jealous when you see this fish. This is the best one we got so far. Oh, boy. This is no throwback, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, hot diggity. Oh, oh, no, I'm not letting him take any line. I'm bringing him home. Oh, loose steel. Oh, Luke. oh. Look at him. He's Go. taking it. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Doc. You're supposed to pull him in. Oh, yeah. We're pulling him. Oh, don't worry. Woo. Oh, loose seal. Oh. <laughs> Wait till you see this one. You're all going to be so jealous. Oh. You better get the gun. This is a big one. Oh, yes. Look at him. Oh, it's a dandy. Oh, you are right. Oh, it's a dandy. Oh, it's a dandy. Oh, yeah. We're going to harpoon him. Yep. Where's he at? He's right down there. He's in the water. Oh. Bring him up. I am. I'm bringing him. He's going to harpoon this one. Okay, Captain. Start easing forward. Doc, you don't have him hooked very well, so be careful. Well, you want me to go forward? Yeah. You foul hooked him, Doc, so be careful. Oh, right. Doc, oh, right. oh, oh. Excuse me. Is he foul hooked, Bill? Oh, yes, he is foul hooked. Hook. Right, here we go. Up to the corner of that rail. All right. All right. Raise him up just a little bit, Doc. Oh, Don't let him get away, Doc. No, no. Yes, there you go. There you go. Ooh, that hurt. Damn it. That's a big one. Right in the bone. Right in the hook. That hard man's stuck. No, no. no. You gotta get more on him. Big one. I'm gonna bring him in again. Don't worry. <laughs> I told you I had a good one. Well, he's not. You know, mine is getting sort of lonely in that ice box. So. Well, yeah. Well, don't worry. <laughs> We're going to change this one's address. <laughs> oh, nice one. Good job, Frank. What'd you get, Frank? Frank got a salmon. salmon. Excellent. All right. Nice silver. Nice silver. Come on, Doc, hurry up. We're getting time running out of film. Wait, He's coming. Yep, there we go. Nice silver. Whatever you get, that's a nice silver. That's a 10-pound silver. I hit the infamous bone. I mean, I, I hit it as hard as I could hit it. It was not moving through. That's a beaut. That's a 10 pound silver. Oh, he's 12. 12? Yeah. I'll tell you, at first, when I, I knew it was something hard, then I, I, I slacked one and I said, suck her, you off. Well, that's a I beautiful fish. Thing. Beautiful fish, Frank. You gonna have that one stuffed? No. I stuffed the days a little bit. <clears throat> what, do you take the line off you, Doc? Oh, he's, he's, I'm, take, I'm bringing him in. Don't worry. We're going to change this one's address. You're still changing addresses? Oh, yeah. First yeah, this is Obadiah. Well, you fellas are just all jealous. Boy, he doesn't want to come in. He's scared of you. He's got all kinds of holes in him. <laughs> Maybe they ought to bring the rifle out and shoot him. No, I think so. <coughs> Not yet. Are you seeing him yet? No. Where's my cameraman, Don? Hey, let's have my dad run over there. Okay. I'll come around. Hold that silver up, right? One second, I'm waiting. Where's that, where's that little gadget? Here, I'm here. Okay. Oh. He's coming up again. There he is. There he is. It's Moby Dick. It's Moby Dick. 
Oh, there he is. Come on now, Doc, don't, don't be messing with him this time. Yeah, yeah. That'll be good. Oh, there he is. You want his blood? Oh, he's back again, back for more. Okay, what happened? I lost the I lost the I lost the You shouldn't lose screen. He just took another run. He, he saw that address book and he didn't like it. That. Howard, how long did it take you to get that fish in? Oh, it was a long while. It was a big fight. I'll tell you, but I changed his address. <laughs> I'll tell you, it was a dandy. Is and that then the, the captain, when he, when he harpooned it, he harpooned it in the, in the spine and it didn't go through. And then the fish took another run. He got mad at you. Oh, he was irritated. Oh. Yeah. Okay, very good catch. These are dwarf nandinas. They get about three feet high. They'll have red foliage throughout the winter, white flowers in the springtime, and red berries in the late summer. These are cherry laurels at Highland Hill Farm on Route 313 in Fountainville. This is a plant for semi-shade or sun. It's easy to grow. It's upright in habitat. It has nice, bright, deep colored green foliage. It also has white flowers in the springtime. It grows upright to about 10 feet high. It's used for screens and buffers where arborvitaes won't grow because of shade conditions. It's not an expensive plant. We grow quite a few of them and we have lots of other trees and shrubs for you to come and look at here at Highland Hill Farm. So give us a call at 215 651-8329 for your skip laurels. Thank you. These are our two to three foot green giants that we have. These are in a number three pot and they're a nice starter plant. There will probably be nothing that we deliver that will be below three feet but we call them two to three foot because when we're measuring them what's one two, three. We don't count this little bit of a tip. So that we call that a two to three foot plant. And as you can see, we have about a couple, couple hundred maybe in here. We're on Route 313 in Fountainville, PA. This is Bill Hurst at Highland Hill Farm. And we grow quite a few of these. We have many different greenhouses full of different types of trees, plants, and shrubs. And if you want to come up, you can. You can pick out the ones you want, or we can deliver. We have trucks on the road all the time going to D.C., New York, Long Island, and all over. So give us a call at 215-651-8329. Thank you.